Hi everyone, it's Tarnished Treasures and today I'm making some things with these vintage doorknobs. I picked some up at the thrift store with the thoughts of turning them into something because I love the look of these porcelain and even the glass doorknobs. So my first idea is to turn these into ephemera holders or photo holders. So I have some sturdy wire that is easy to bend but holds its shape and some wire cutters. So I originally wrapped this once and thought that's all I would do, but then I thought, you know what, I've got all that extra wire, why don't I do another loop and then it can hold more than one piece of ephemera. To start, I cut a length of wire and I would say this is about 12 inches. I'd rather have more than less. And I just need something round to wrap it around. Uh, if you try and do this by eye, <laughs> doesn't look so good. So what I did is I inserted the wire inside this little hole where the nut would go and, uh, or the screw would go. And then I'm just gonna wrap it around and that's gonna give me probably the best looking circle. And you could wrap this several times and then you could have many loops to have all different pieces of paper. So I don't, usually like to do a lot of ephemera on one piece. So I think I've gone around like three, three and a half times. So now I'm gonna take it out of that little hole. So I'm just gonna pull it. And then I'm gonna snip it off where the bend is because it's really hard to get it to go uh, with the curve again. And then just try and use your pliers to get it back together. So very nice and neat. <clears throat> so you can adjust this to any height just by bending it. And just use the tension and it holds it so easily. So I could snip this off here and then there you go. You've got one or you could create one that was a little bit taller and round up here. Here see. There you go. So let's put something in there. I have this ephemera that I want to display in my kitchen and See how easy, I guess I could spread them apart to get it in, but I don't want to take the tightness and the tension away. So there you go. I'm very pleased with that. So I also started uh, this one because I have two knobs and I already have the circle for the one side, but I'd like to make this one a double. So I'm not trimming off any of this extra and I'm gonna curl it around and see how that goes. I have my double, so I will insert that into my knob. They seem to cross a little. Now I could definitely put them in different directions or I could cross them. I think I'll do this taller piece back here. And then I will do, I suppose they're easy wire to bend. And then if they ever lose their shape or get too loose, you just get some more wire and redo it again. Oh, I like that a lot. This was such a quick project, and I love going to the thrift store and being drawn to something, bringing it home and transforming it into something useful for my house. So I needed a way to display these pieces of Christmas ephemera, and I used to have a cork board, but I don't anymore. And picture frames would have taken up too much space over here, not to mention the fact that the items are three-dimensional. So this worked out perfectly. I think it goes with my aesthetic, and it was something that was simple and fun. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in another video.